Hey, what's up guys? This is Spencer from Pixel and Bracket. In this video, we're gonna be looking at how to add and customize a slideshow gallery on a Wix mobile site. So I've got a big full width slideshow added to this photography website. Now to add slideshow, you can go over to the add button in the toolbar. That's gonna pop open a bunch of different things you can add to your site. Underneath gallery, you're gonna find different types of slideshows. Underneath interactive, you'll find some as well. And then underneath strip, you might find some different strips that you can use in a slideshow type of way. Now these include both photos and text and video, but I'm just gonna be looking at adding photos within a gallery style slideshow. Now, if we switch over to the mobile view by clicking the little phone icon, we can see our slideshow right here within the mobile editor. We can adjust the settings of it by clicking on the gear icon after we've selected the slideshow, and we have a bunch of settings. So starting from the top down to the bottom, we can select whether or not it auto plays on loading. That means the slideshow is gonna go through its transitions once the visitor has reached the page. We can also adjust how long between the images. So how long is it going to pause and wait between each image before transitioning. Now if this is set to zero, you're gonna see flickering on your website, so you're gonna to want to make sure this is above zero seconds. We can also show titles and descriptions, just the title, just the description, or even no text on our slideshow. I'm gonna keep it at no text for now. And then we can adjust what type of transition effect we're gonna use. Whether or not it slides from left to right, crossfades, zooms in and out, or even randomizes the transitions. You can also select none if you don't want any of those special effect transitions. Now we can also go to layout here and adjust how the text is aligned. Since we don't have any text, we're not gonna be able to see that. And then we can hide this element on our mobile site as well. Now if we switch back over to the desktop view, we do have some more customization options. As I click on this slideshow, I can see my options up here. If I go into change images, it's gonna let us adjust the images within this gallery. So the first thing we can do is we can see what images are available and then we can reorder them if we want to just by clicking and dragging the images in front or behind of each other just like this. Now, if we want to add new images, we can click this orange button, add images, and we can upload media or we can even select free images from Wix. I'm gonna select this misty woodland background and add that to my gallery. Now it's set up as the first image and I can hit done and we see now that image is the first image that shows up. If we go back to the mobile view of our site, we can see that it adjusts there as well and we actually get more dots or indicators of how many images are in our slideshow. If we preview this, we're gonna see that this every two and a half seconds like we have it set up is going to transition through this slideshow. So those are some of the options you have when setting up slideshows both sort of on the desktop version and here in the mobile editor. Now each of these slideshows tends to come with different settings and layout options, depending on whether you pulled it from the gallery, interactive, or even the, the adding a strip to your website. So just make sure you go through those settings. They're gonna have different layout options, they're gonna have different text options, and they're gonna have different ways to insert images. But that's the basic way to work with slideshows in the mobile editor and also on the desktop version of your Wix website. Thanks for watching. Subscribe for more tips and tutorials, and I'll see you guys next time.